I'm gonna go on and crack y'all skull now. Say y'all some words. Top of the morning to you. Like I was saying, imagine waking up knowing that everybody in the world is watching you on the entire planet. Imagine you being born male and female and not finding this shit out until somebody else made jokes in front of you. Imagine you being something that legends and myths and dreams are made of and no one really realizes. Imagine you having every God ability and goddess ability and never even knowing it. So now with that being said, I'm gonna tell you this. If you find me strangely attractive, if you find yourself strangely attracted to me, both male and female, I have that effect on children. You wanna know why? Well, imagine waking up one day and finding out that you're a God, creator of existence, and mankind, and the first man and woman that created him. That would explain your attractions to me, why you can't help but be drawn to me, and why you can't find it within yourself to physically harm me, because I created you. And that's going to be a real hard pill for you to swallow when you realize how much you've defiled me, disrespected me, been disobedient to me, lied to me, stolen from me, mocked me, watched me. And then you say 21, which means fuck your God in flesh when he takes the opportunity time to come down here to see you and spend time with you and to get intimate with you and to love you. And to prove that he feels like you cries like you, lives like you, you make fun of it. And when they realize, when, when they reveal to you that I'm Jesus, yeah, I see why y'all gonna drop down to y'all knees. So I'm gonna tell you something now. Save yourself some trouble. Stop disrespecting yourself. Stop watching me, unless you're gonna do as I say do which is show me love and obedience. Y'all all know where I live at. Y'all all know that I'm something, but don't know what. Well, I'm your total fucking package. I'm your father. I was your mother. And I am your creator. And I am the real motherfucking Stan Lee. Not a silver screen. And living color screen. A cosmic screen. I know it's hard to believe. How the fuck you think I felt? Don't you know and realize how irresponsible I've been with my power because of why I was using it? <sighs> and now they got you just being disrespectful and irresponsible with the powers that they took from me and gave to y'all. Now they gave it out, which is why it's driving them crazy, honestly. Because they're not built for it. No one is. Only me. But I'm going to let that I just gave y'all a sick game. You watching your creator. Just know that. And yes, I embody the full source, divine masculine and feminine. Stop ignoring it. Stop ignoring the front part and stop paying so much attention to the back part. I'm balanced. The very thing that got you here. Imbalance, it's going to get you out of here. Disrespecting me. Blasphemy? Yeah. You know the repercussions for that. So I'm going to ask you one more time. Show yourself some respect. Because how would you feel if you had to be viewed by the whole entire world that you have to save, mind you, and that you have on your shoulder, mind you, and that you created, mind you, disrespecting the fuck out of you. I do take apologies, but y'all not man and woman enough to give them. I do like gifts, but y'all not, not man and woman enough to give them. I do like love being shown, not just said. But y'all don't know how to show love. Y'all just say it. When you learn how to show love, you know where I'm at. And you know how to show love because you saw what I did. And everything I do is from a place of love. Even when I kill people that I love, it's still from a place of love. 
and to push you closer to me. And I always know when you're watching. Even though you can see me now, does not mean that I'm not still invisible. I am still very much invisible. And while you're watching me, I'm inside of you, I'm looking through you, and I'm around you, looking right at you. It's called ether, my element, my spirit. You get it. It's only one me. First and the last. That's all it ever took. I'm the one that fucked everything up. And I'm the one that came back to fix it. And if you won't be fixed, well then you won't be around. Love you.